Here, as you can see, I have another function that allows me to do all the evaluation, whether or not it is necessary to include the torsion, where I start to do my calculations here, they are associated with what I have here, well, for example, that value of lambda that. You see there I'm calculating it lambda s where I have the square root of the whole operation that here in Excel I have all this that you see here where I'm interacting with my values I also have it here directly in pi then over here. I have a phi sigma sub c that this would be these two both this one and the one here because of these two you have to evaluate and take the maximum. All this from here is already related to the 318 and all this little formula that you see here I have embedded. This here and this and both of them I'm getting the most. This value here I'm also taking it and then of these two I'm choosing the maximum and I'm storing it in this variable. So all this is in terms of what would be due to cutting force, but we must also understand cutting due to torsion. These formulas, well, those are standards, let's say, and I have them here too. So all this that you visualize here corresponds to the design of a beam of this project.